Where did the word sheriff come from? To understand the origin, we must travel back to what is known today as England, where the term reeve referred to a chief or leader, and the term shire described groups of hundreds of people banded together, which is what we would today call a county. So it makes sense that the leader of a shire was called the Shire Reeve, who was appointed by noblemen and kings to maintain peace and tranquility. This term eventually evolved into the modern word sheriff. The role of sheriff came into existence around the 9th century, which makes the sheriff the oldest continuing non-military law enforcement entity in history. English settlers traveled across the Atlantic and brought with them the office of sheriff. The first American sheriff was elected in 1651. It wasn't until 1821 that Florida law enforcement truly began when the state's first territorial governor, Andrew Jackson, issued the Jackson Ordinance and created Florida's initial two counties, Escambia in the west and St. John's in the east. Jackson appointed James Hannum, sheriff of St. John's County, and Henry Pear, sheriff of Escambia County, which established the first law enforcement officers in the state. In 1868, David Montgomery became Florida's first African-American sheriff to be appointed by the governor, and it was in 1889 that Charles DuPont became the first popularly elected sheriff when he took the oath of office in Monroe County. In 1938, Eugenia Simmons and Celia Jernigan became the first female sheriffs of Florida when they were appointed after the death of their husbands. The first popularly elected female sheriff was Marguerite Baldry in 1946, when she won a special election in Sumter County. Today, Florida's sheriffs serve as one of a handful of constitutional Florida offices. What does this mean? Well, it means that the sheriff's power is established by the Florida Constitution and that the person who serves the office of sheriff is elected by the citizens of the county through the general ballot. The duly elected sheriff of a county is the highest law enforcement official within that county. They have law enforcement powers that exceed any other state or federal official. Sheriffs are vested with the authority to appoint deputies to act in their name and are authorized to perform the sheriff's duties. Today, there are more than 30,000 sheriff's office personnel across the state serving 67 counties. In addition to law enforcement and corrections, many sheriff's offices are responsible for the operation of the county jail and providing deputies to serve as bailiffs who provide court security. Sheriff's offices are also responsible for delivering court documents, subpoenas, summons, and complaints on behalf of the Florida Supreme Court, Circuit Court, County Court, and Board of County Commissioners. Florida sheriffs have led several efforts to develop statewide training and accreditation programs to ensure all law enforcement has the latest education and training. Sheriffs are actively involved with their communities through volunteering at local charities and hosting educational events for the public. You will often see the sheriff out in the community working to make a difference every day. Your sheriff is here to serve and protect you. To learn more about all of Florida's 67 sheriffs and how you can support the Office of Sheriff, please visit www.flsheriffs.org.